In the town of Southport, the streets are colorful, people are walking around with shopping bags, and vendors are setting up shop, which means the North Carolina 4th of July Festival is underway. Southport Mayor Sandy Spencer knows the town is about to step into some serious money. The festival brings in close to $42 million. Sales tax revenues alone for Brunswick County for the holiday period will be somewhere in the neighborhood of $11,000. That doesn't sound like a lot, but uh, that's money that actually comes back to us. The festival even helps hotels shine in the busiest of ways. Ever since the Hampton Inn opened nine years ago, it's booked every 4th of July weekend. It's like Christmas in July for us. It's a big boost. The beginning of the summer, a lot of leisure travelers coming to town. A successful 4th of July festival is felt far beyond the town of Southport. It even has a positive effect on Oak Island and those in the realty business. Margaret Rudd Bishop owns Margaret Rudd and Associates Realty Company. She says the festival attracts people who otherwise would never visit the town. And they come and they say, wow, this is really nice. And they come back and, and now many of those same folks are my neighbors. This week her business is shooting off and booking rentals. I would say perhaps it's uh, maybe uh, three to three to five percent more demand. A demand in a town that takes its place statewide for Fourth of July festivities as something they really have in the bag. In Brunswick County, Gavin Johnson, WECT News.